Welcome back, one and all, pro Spartan game hour with Spartacus Legends, and what an episode this could be. Um, we are proposing to fight Ixion, the legend in the pits, in this episode, but I am not sure how many times and who with. I am tempted to throw in Calvanius, the heavy hammer man, against the heavy hammer man, just to see what he's like. Or thoughts have also gone to throwing in Argus, or even the legend, Acolytus. To fight him to see what he's like before we go in with real big Vic. Um, so I know it's going to be a tough fight. I am quite tempted by a f um, tossing in a Colitus against Ixion for an all legends match. Um, just to see what he's like. But first and foremost, we've got Argus going in against the mystery challenger in the Market Alley district again as he continues his rise up the gladiatorial ladder. Um, 16 from 17, starting to look the business, starting to up him now, needs, needs to produce the goods in this fight and then it will be on to the pits probably for Argus or the midnight battle one in, in the gladiatorial small arena where we've seen so many other legendary fights in the past where Masonus was finished by Juro in that magical fight. Anyway, cock in the wind. Stick your chest out, stick your daggers in the heart of your opponent. Come on, Argus. Here we are then, Market Alley. Argus up in it, Spear and Shield. That is hard to get close to. This is going to be a tough one. Although he's lower rank, these are always difficult to get in tight to. They've got that thrust that they use. That's what I mean. Dear me, this is a tough one. What a tough fight this is. Him down, but he's struggling here. Our goose showing a bit of heart though, which is good. It's a real tough cookie, this guy. There it is. Second defeat for our goose. Not a good start to episode 38 here for Spartacus Legends. Our goose showing he's still not up for it against Spear and Shield. Whoa, real tough one. Couldn't get close to him. So quick with the Spear and Shield. And so accurate with the blows. Real difficult one. Lesser ranked opponent, but very good. Couldn't get near to him. Argos is still not good enough yet. You go to the pits or somewhere like that, and there's his second defeat on his... Mantelpiece. Stay tuned for the next fight. Next up is Big Boy Gelnius. He's rising from the flames of Shit Eater after winning such an emphatic fight against a legend in this arena. He's going in against the Mystery Challenger in this district to try and earn some pride back in the market alley for House Batiatus. Always a tough one, as you just seen Argus lose. Can Gelnius do the business? Here we are then, who's he up against? He's got dual daggers. Galnus is certainly up there. He's become a decent gladiator of late, but this is going to be a tough, another tough one for him. Come back from the. Now there's a fucking gladiator. 
That's good stuff. Nip and tuck this one. Good fight, actually. Well done, Gaunius. Got his man down first. He's got plenty of perks, this guy. This ain't an easy fight. Got him around the backside. He's down as well. This is nipping the bird. Whew. Two real tight fights at the beginning of this episode. Get out of there. Got me with a pork and sausage. Got me with it again. This is Nip. We're going to lose this. Now we've lost it. Nip and Tuck. Gaunius loses a tight fight as well in the market alley. And episode 38 is turning into a disaster for House Batiatus. Making me very nervous to send anyone in against the big boy this, I tell you. Two fights, two losses. Not a great start to the episode. Not at all. Oh dear. Makes you feel the nerves of a tangling for the fight in the pits. And that is Gaunius has now lost five. And this guy's won twice now, this Adolfius. He's obviously a bit of a gladiator of worth against my Lutus. He loves picking him off. Here it is then, the fight you've all been waiting for. The Lutus fight and the Lutus, the Primus fight of episode 38 is real big Vic against Ixion. What a fight. What a massive fight this is. Can we do it? I don't know. He's so quick. He's so hard to f battle. I don't think we're going to be able to do it. Could be the end of real big. First, though, we're tempting you with the Ixian fight, but we're going to throw him in against Sigrid the Heartless. think this is an easier one for Real Big Vic, and this is the one you're going to see first. Come on, Sigrid the Heartless is going to go down to Real Big Vic. Come on. Come on. This is the Primus fight of episode 38. Not the main one against Big Boy Ixian yet. We've not decided who we're going to throw in against Ixian. Is it going to be Victor or is it going to be a, a Colotos? We don't know. Here we go then. We lost Gladiators here. We lost Juro to this guy. We do not want to lose Victor. Come on, Vic. You can do it, son. You know how quick he is. Look at him. Real Let's fine go. Gladiator go. worth secret. Keep him penned. Oh, that's a good move from him there, though, wasn't it? Good start from Vic, though. Juro never had him in this much trouble. Got him down first. Come on, feathers up. Come on, Victor. Come on, Victor! Punching him, got him with that one. Come on! Yes, Seagrad! Come on, you're gonna die for killing Juro! And he has died! What a defeat! Real big beating Seagrad the Harkness! Great win here in episode 38. The win that you wanted, the win that you needed. Come on! What a win. We needed that win for House Batiatas. The start of this episode had been poor. It really had. Whoa, Secret's gone for defeating Juro. Fantastic stuff. There it is. He's gone. What do we get for that? We've leveled up to 15, which is good news. We need all we can get to fight. It's 
swift sandals, that's a bit of speed. No, we decline that one. We need all we can get to fight bloody Ixian, I reckon. Let's see what we've got here to level up and who we've actually unlocked in that district. Now Seagrid is gone. If Seagrid is gone, who has been unlocked? It's, oh, we need a hammer man to fight a spear and shield. Woo, is Calvanius up to it? Not sure he is. What a fight that's going to be. It's Crixus in that area, don't forget. So we're not going to be doing that at the moment, I don't think. Let's see what we can do in our Lutus with the levelling up before we end this episode. Is there anything else a real big can have? Not really. Nothing better for him to have at the moment on that. Damage is down by quite a lot if we get that. But the others are improved. That's the one we want, but we haven't got that yet on new play. It's not available. That's the real one you want. 27 gold though. Tempting, isn't it? It is tempting for 27 gold. Look at it, what it gives us. Gives us so much more. Yes. We've got the nice helmet on now. We've got the provocateur helmet. Look at him. What an absolute tank. Leons of Lion. They give you something as well. Everything goes up faster there. Spending them touch sweet on this series. We are. We're investing in it. That's what we like to see. The game didn't cost us anything. So we don't care if we use some gold. Anything better on the sandals. Again, they're better there. The Tiger's Chase. Everything goes up again. We will use that as well. We want to make sure these gladiators are gladiators of worth. And he's gone up now. He's 174 rated. Let's go back and see what we can do with the rest of the guys. Gelnius and the like. Not a lot better than he's got there. That's for sure. Don't want to worry about that. They are some good stuff. He's got them from Uplay. He can have the helmet on. In fact, they are all have the same arm, won't they? Because it will give them every... All of them will be improved by it. There's no doubt about that. House Batiatas has had an upgrade today, don't you worry. We're hoping it's going to do us good for the big battles ahead. Well, that doesn't do much for him there, really. His damage goes up, but his health and that defence go down, so we're leaving with what he's got on there. Who's up next? Calvanius. He's going to have to be... Unless we can beat Ixion, he is going to have to be bled for that massive fight. Well, we can't spend 20 gold on it. I'm afraid, Calvinius, you're not having 20 gold spent on you. He has the helmet. He can have the loins of the lion. And he can have that if it improves him. And it does. He's up to 130. Calvinius, only a green, don't forget. Fighting way above his station, to be fair. Masonist we can't do nothing with. What can we do? Drossus the dog. Can he have a better? Not really. Probably could have we spent the money, but we're not going to. Here are the helmet. Here are the cow heart, the leo loins of the lion. And he can have them as well. Look how far he goes up with them. Fantastic. Right up miles. The Tiger's chase on. And last one is Argus, isn't it? What will Argus? He's already under an 83. Could he make it to the 200 mark? Hmm. 
Well, next one he needs are an awful lot of tut sweep really on the weaponry. And no on the weaponry. Yes, you can go up on the old helmet and he'd go up to 186. Cowhide braces, he has the loins of the lion. 191. The chance he could go up in the 190 easy will. 195 now. Highest gladiator we've ever had, but he's still losing fights. So all of them are equipped. We can't do nothing with a, co a Colitos or Masonus. They're what they are. They are what they are. Just want one fight then, do you, to see the end? See us in this new kit, I suppose. Would be a fair shout. Just an ordinary dog dogger fight. One that we should beat quite easy. Mystery challenger in first district. With the new juice on. Won't be going to be Calvanius. Haven't seen him for a day or two. See how he gets on with the new helmet. Last fight of episode 38. We beat Sigrid the Harkness. You had to wait for Ixion for another day. I was too scared to go in there. It's going to have to be in incoming episodes, guys. I'm sorry about that. Come on, then. Come on, Calvanius. You've got big fights ahead of you, son. you got real big fights. Nice we got the blue feathers. Matching our. Let honored blood be shed. Now then, spear and shield. Good stuff, this from Galvanius. Got us though with a donut move. He's got coming back with a few though. We got him with a dentist. We love it when we get him with a dentist, and that's a win for Calvanius with the dentist chair and all. Great win with a new helmet on. Great stuff, Calvanius. Didn't see him ending it there with the dentist chair, but he did, and that was quite comprehensive stuff to end episode 39, 38, sorry. So, a couple losses for Argus and Galnius at the beginning. We saw real Vic, we were scared of Ixion, so we went in against Sigurd the Harkness and sent him to the afterlife. And you've just seen Calvanius win his 21st fight with the new gear on to end episode 38. Thanks for joining me guys, I've been the Pro Spartan Gamer and I'll catch you next time for more of this great game. Cheers.